Hello there, my name is Jack and I'm an engineer here at Draytech and today I would like to talk to you about this. This is the Draytech Vigor 130 uh, VDSL modem. Now this device is basically designed to act as a bridge between your connection coming into the building and the Ethernet interface of another router. So this could be um, any router that supports an Ethernet based WAN port, um, something like the Draytech 3900 or 2960 series of routers, um, or even something like the 2860 uh, because it has a secondary Ethernet based WAN port. Now, the device is designed to be as simple as possible. So on the back of the device, um, we have an uh, Ethernet port, which is your kind of output, and then the input, which is your DSL port here. And basically what you would have is something like a fibre to the cabinet connection, your BT Infinity type uh, line coming into the building, plugged directly into one of these, and then fed out through the Ethernet port into the WAN port of your router. Now it's designed, as I said, to work with any router, but it's specifically very useful uh, with the 2860 series of router, and there's a reason for that. So in the 2860, you have a VDSL modem built into it. But there could be the situation where you have two high-speed lines coming into the building and you want a load balance between the two. Maybe you have some serious uh, kind of data requirements and uh, FTTC is uh, available in your area. The Vigor 130 is designed exactly expressly for this purpose. And basically what you can do is you can take your uh, DSL cable and you can plug it into the back of the unit here, like so. And say so this is your line coming into the building. And then basically what you do is you just grab any old Ethernet cable, plug it into there, plug it into there, and you're good to go basically. That's it. The Vigor 130 is designed to be a no-touch um, setup, so it basically comes pre-configured to work with this type of line. All you do is you plug it into the line, plug it into the router, and then just go into the router and set up your username and password that you would use for your ISP. And it's as simple as that. So there's full product details for, available for the Vigor 130 uh, from the draytech.co.uk website. Uh, by all means, go check that out. You can find the details for the 2860 as well. Um, and if you do have any questions about that, then, of course, as always, please do feel free to get in contact with us, and you know, we're always happy to help. Thanks for listening today.